It was a great idea to bribe one of the trolls. Once they begin to riot, Garen will do something and the trolls will be confused. We also need to find the weakest, meanest elves and dragons and do the same with them. Charles, up to no good. Charles, 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 you are a bad person. But this is a sequel, so Charles is dead, right? I thought so. So, I have a cane now. Hmm. I can heat the potion. Why do we need a... Well, I, our little white dragon got hit with a poison arrow, so... We're trying to save the day. Trying to save the day. Looks like we have to go back in here for reasons that are beyond me. Or not. Really? Back here? Sometimes I get turned around in these games and I'm like, why in the world would you need to go back that way? Stone? Okay. Fork? Tong? Maybe the fork tongs go here? Oh, nasty! Poor thing. I don't know what poison Gorin used for his arrows. That ugly troll is capable of anything. He's attempted to hurt me many times, but this time, he was successful. Darn troll. Thank you for removing that arrow, but I still don't have the strength to carry you to the Valley of Dragons. I've heard you elves have a book of potions. Maybe this is the right one. Take a look. That may be the right one, I don't know. I mean, how many diaries are laying around here? If someone breaks the boundaries of this world and it begins to collapse, an urgent evacuation is required. Yes, our dragon can totally talk. The shortest way out of the game is through the Valley of Dragons. There's a magical artifact hidden among their treasures. When the artifact finds its right place, the path to the Valley of Trolls will open. In the Valley of Trolls, it's a portal to the safe place. Get there and step into the portal to save yourself. Jeez, it's trying to like make it seem like we have like four hours of game left here. Oh, and a brush. Uh, oh, I guess that's not a brush. Why do we need a brush? Oh no, we need to regain strengths here. I'm not exactly sure what we need the brush for. Apparently back here. Uh, oh. oh, to get pollen. Of course we need the brush for pollen. Now we're ready to heal our dragon buddy. Now I'll pound it. The girl's on fire? Wait, what? Which girl? Wait a minute, how can there be girls on fire? So I now have unbrewed potion. We're gonna brew it up. Hot stuff. All right, feed it to the dragon. Or take a bath in it or whatever. Thank you. Now I can take you to our dungeon where you'll find a way to stop Gorin. We have a special artifact in our crystal hall. Hop on my back. <laughs> Finally, we get to hop on her back. Wait, what are we doing? There's no time left. You must get the artifact from the Crystal Hall while I guide my people to a safe place. Dragon is so pretty. Why are you so pretty, dragon? And why you leave me? 
Don't go! I hope I'll manage to locate the artifact in this unfamiliar place. I hope I get to ride the dragon again. I think we should say, uh, too bad for the artifact, and we're gonna go hop on the dragon. So last of our artifacts, dragon wifey, exactly. Any troll with his salt never wears a hat, but prefers an imposing headdress. While maintaining ferocity, the troll remains cozy thanks to the knitted beanie every troll mother hides inside every crown. Okay. That's random ish. Gold nuggets! Eggshells and such. It would be useful to widen the crack. How? With a fork? Nope. Observe the balance. Everything has balance, right? It's a good surface for crushing stuff. Hmm. Can we use our cane? Yes, we can. Thank you for that torch, if you would kindly release the torch. Uh, how about a pitchfork here? Nope. There you go. There you go. I need a tool to get the metal ring. Spike it up. Random screwdriver. I don't think that's going to be the right tool, though. No, I didn't think so. So I have a flask. I've got dragon eggshells, a scraper. Who doesn't? Dragon, dragon, dragon. Exactly. Melt it. Melt it if you got it. Ooh, a handsome board. I'm bored. <laughs> That's one of my favorite things when people come to watch live streams and they're like, I'm bored. <laughs> And why are you here? Uh, where are we? Oh, I guess we're like, that's it. We're here. This is it. This is what we do. And this is how we do it. Now, I've got a ton of stuff here. Look at all this junk. Stone and a scraper and uh, eggshells and a flask and a spike screwdriver board. I'm bored. <laughs> uh, yep. Good for crushing eggs. Crush it up. Put it in the little flasky thing. Well, I appreciate that, Rebecca. I thank you for that. Hey, look, I'm okay if people are bored. I just don't need to see it in chat. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, life is short. Find something else to do, right? Anyways, we got things, and uh, we're going to go ahead and balance this out here. Let's start with some coolers. Uh, who says I didn't ban the word? I don't know. So green, red, boom! Yes, of course, 99% of the time, if you listen to chat without context, it could be a little problem. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alright, we've got candles. Let's do it. Whoa, that was a weird sound. Well, I appreciate that, Sage McFloy. I appreciate that. Shield it up. Wow, that wind is windy. If you know what I mean. Hammer time. 
Where the heck are we putting this? I'm bored! Actually, you know what? In general, if anyone says that to me, I just look at them and go, in this world, with all of the things at your fingertips, how could you be bored? I'm never bored. I just find something to do. Like, it's not that hard. <laughs> okay, what do we got? Yes, I am a bored. B O A R D. Uh, I think as a uh, subscriber on Twitch, you're probably going to be exempt from anything that would get a normal person the boot. Could be either. I'm a bored board. Okay, what am I doing here? My kingdom for a key. You're just tro tro trolling. Not a worries. Not a worry at all. Where is this tear here? The salty tear. Ah, <sighs> there it is. I'm okay with people feeling that way. I'm okay with... What I'm not okay with is hearing about it. That's my distinction. Bum, 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 bored. I'm bored. <laughs> oh my gosh. The English language. So much fun. Whoa, it's another dragony dragon. Why is there a doggy here? Hey there, I'm Shayla Zhu. Do you need help? I bet you do. I can help you if you untie me. Is this guy talking in riddles or what? Hey, we finally found the blue dragoon. <laughs> Your daughter says I'm boring? There you go. That's a little fun bit right there. All aboard the board. Ooh, we got some dynamite. Look at that. Dynamite. High time I learned to pick the locks. Periwinkle Dragon, where have you been? <gasps> what the heck is this creature? I am not sure what animal you are. Looks like more treats for you. Oh, <laughs> lame board is lame. Don't trust the periwinkle dragon, but, but, why, why, is that a wombat, really, you're making that up, it's a pretty face, I don't know where you get, it looks like a chinchilla, it could be that too, so, we have a boat here, that we can't get into, we have a net, which is creating some uh, problems. I know, look, I'm bored. I'm boring. I'm a boring board. It's the little things, right? Like, I don't know. It's, I'm not sure how else to describe it, but, um, ooh, I bet you dynamite goes there. <gasps> dynamite. We gotta figure out how to make you go boom. My goal is to find the key. Oh, that's not where that goes. That has to go back this way. On here. Ah! You know what? Misty can't worry about the numbers. I'm here. <laughs> Seriously? I'm here for crowbars. I'm clearly not here for the audience. I'm here because of crowbars. You know what, whether it's five people or 500 people, you gotta have fun either way. <gasps> Why? No, seriously, now this is ridiculous. Was this eight, eight crowbars? This is getting a little... <laughs> It's getting a little cray cray with my crowbars. That is funny. Like, I'm not complaining. Don't get me wrong. That. 
<laughs> OMG. We that's exactly what we needed. A smorgasbord of crowbars. And the wombat was guarding it. Yes. Go, wombat, go. And we have a lighter, and we're gonna light it up, up, up. Gimme, gimme, never gets. A boom. Hello, crowbar. What are you up to? Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> the devs are trying to desensitize your feelings for crowbars. There's so much gratuitous crowbars. It makes me angry and happy at the same time. Oh, thank you. I'm a great warrior, but this time I lost. Gurren is a fool if he thinks that the only way to prove his strength is destroying our world. You freed me, so I'll keep my promise. The crystal that activates the passage to the world of trolls is stored in our crystal hall. Bring it to me, and I'll help you reach the trolls. Here, uh, this will help. <laughs> like the dude with this screwdriver in his paw. Oh, it's a lockpick. Never mind. We have freed the dragon. We are a hero a liberator. So here's the thing, right? So this game was released in 2018, clearly developed or, or you know, made in 2017. But I, you know what? I almost need to mark down the maybe my new award system <laughs> needs to be different categories like the most mermaids the sexiest dragons the cutest bears and the most number of crowbars you know like come up with some different types of awards and so far this game is definitely winning two awards so far the cutest dragon and the most number of crowbars Dragon is vaping. Wow. Oh, it's a card. 13 out of 14 cards. Let's have a look see here. I forget where we left off here. Oh, we've got three dragons so far. Wow. There's a pink beauty. She's the one that got the poison arrow. This is the guy that we just saved, which we we got this card in the main game, so we didn't even know who this guy was. This was the dragon from the main game. 